So we have seen that the leaves are called the kitchen or the food factory of the plant because it prepares its own food and with the presence of chlorophyll and sunlight. If you take notice each tree is or plant is unique and they have different leaves and leaves of different shapes and sizes. So we have some common shapes and structure of a leaf. So we have some with a lot of leaves but the mid rib, the mid vein is the same. So these are the different types of leaves we have in front of us. Next moving on to the two types of plants that is flowering plants and non flowering plants. So flowering plants are a type of plant that so flowering plants are a type of plant that produces flowers in order to reproduce. Reproduce is giving a rise to a new plant or giving birth. So flowering plants are a type of plant that produces flowers in order to reproduce. Flowering plants produce seeds within a fruit. For example, if you take the, a mango, so when you eat a mango, you find a seed inside the fruit and you take that seed and you plant it in the ground, another or a new sapling comes out. So a new tree starts growing. So flowering plants produce seeds within a fruit. They are divided into dicots and the monocots. So, so flowering plants produce seeds within a fruit. They are divided into dicots and the monocots. So a flowering plants are a type of plant, plant that produces flowers in order to reproduce and the flowering plants produce seeds within a fruit and this is further divided into dicots and the monocots. The next is your non-flowering plants. So by the name itself we come to a, we can come to a conclusion that is flowering plants produces flowers and non-flowering plants do not produce flowers. So non-flowering plants are those that do not even produce flowers, that do not ever produce flowers. So as I've said, we can come to a conclusion only by reading the name. Flowering plants produce flowers, non-flowering plants do not ever produce flowers. Some non-flowering plants called gymnosperms. So the other name for non-flowering plants are gymnosperms. Still produce seeds while others use spores for reproduction. So there are certain group of non-flowering flowering plants called gymnosperms that produce seeds while others use spores for reproduction. As we have seen in flowering plants, flowering plants produce seeds within a fruit. Non-flowering plants, there are a certain group of non-flowering flowering plants called gymnosperms that still produce seeds like the flowering plants whereas there, the others use spores for reproduction. So this is the difference between your flowering plant and your non-flowering plant. Flowering plant produces flowers, non-flowering plants do not produce flowers.